Now, your latest news update from Western Mass News. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. The city of Springfield is now in the red high risk category on the state's tracking map for COVID-19 cases. During an emergency briefing, Mayor Dominic Sarno and the city's commissioner of health and human services, Helen Calton Harris, said Springfield cannot move forward in the state's reopening policy, leaving the city stuck in phase three, part one for the time being. They say another 51 COVID cases were reported in the city in just three days this week. Meantime, West Springfield Mayor Will Reichelt says Halloween is still on despite the pandemic, and that includes trick-or-treating with some safety measures in place. They include no communal bowls of candy, wearing masks, and traveling with members of their household only. Mayor Reichelt says COVID-19 makes everything different, but he wants to keep West Springfield traditions alive. And it is October 1st, today, the first day of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. This year, there's an extra push from local health officials due to the coronavirus pandemic. Some things have slipped through the cracks, specifically screenings for breast cancer. A recent survey showing that breast cancer screenings dropped 94% in the month of March. Doctors say for most people, they recommend at the age of 40 to begin checking yearly or every two years. I'm meteorologist Jana Brown to check of your forecast. We do have clear skies this evening, which will be perfect for that full moon rise, but we do get a little cloudy as we head toward the overnight. So we'll have an increase in cloud cover, which will keep temperatures from getting too chilly, but we should likely get back into the upper 40s to near 50 by tomorrow morning. Skies should be cloudy by the time you head out the door early Friday, and we will have some light showers that begin in the morning, and then especially as we get closer to noon, I think we'll see more widespread light rain, and then it tapers off very quickly in the afternoon with some late a clearing, but the cloud cover and the rain will keep highs only in the middle to upper 50s, so a cool day on tap. Now, once this system pulls away, we should actually, we might actually see some good sunshine before the day is even over Friday. And then high pressure takes over, and that will keep us dry and comfortable through the rest of the weekend. Upper level disturbance will bring some scattered clouds Saturday and Sunday, and then we'll be tracking our next storm for Monday. But in the near term, 58 for a high on Friday, 64 partly cloudy Saturday and Sunday. Perfect weekend. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.